The Eboyin state governor, Mr. Martin Elechi, is facing impeachment from some lawmakers in the state as they accuse him of misappropriation of state funds, gross misconduct and embezzlement. And the nine of us are here. The motion for his removal was supported by 15 members out of the 24 lawmakers in the House, falling short of a two-thirds majority according to the state's constitution. The other nine members gathered to brief newsmen on why they will not be part of the impeachment, saying it will destabilize a peace enjoyed in the state. A motion of the House of Assembly that the allegation be investigated shall not be declared as having been passed unless it is supported by the votes of not less than two test majority of all the members of the House of Assembly. That 15 members cannot be the two test majority of all the members of a 24 member House of Assembly. That very desperate attempts and overtures are being made to induce and intimidate us from yielding into yielding against the demand of justice and good conscience to the plot for the impeachment of our dear governor. They also accused the Speaker of the State House of Assembly of contravening Section 188, Subsection 4 of the 1999 Constitution as amended and allegedly collaborating with some other politicians in the state to unlawfully impeach the governor. One of the founding fathers of Eboyin State and an elder statesman, Chief Eguchima, says he's disturbed by the happenings in the political scene. It's not like a question of a mere vision. It's a question of obsession, of that destructive obsession. Don't be governor. Governor of who? At the moment, the governor's yet to make any official response. But the 15 lawmakers who want the governor out have fled the state as they're said to be operating from Abuja, Nigeria's capital city.